move on over, Deadpool. There is a new record breaker at the box office. Flash, Flash, 100 yard dash. Buddy, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you. Two. Zootopia roared into theaters this weekend, claiming the number one spot with nearly $74 million. That is a new record for the biggest Walt Disney Animation Studio opening of all time, beating Frozen 67 million. The flick also earned the fourth highest March opening weekend in box office history. Zootopia has been praised by critics for its message about prejudice and tolerance, earning a 98% rating on Rotten Tomatoes. At its A Cinema score, and the PG rated movie should hold up pretty well over the next few weeks. An attack has decimated the British capital. London Has Fallen is Gerard Butler's second movie in two weeks to debut at number two. The R-rated action epic earned nearly $22 million, which isn't as good as the original Olympus Has Fallen that opened in 2013 with more than $30 million. The film received bad reviews, but audiences liked it a lot better, giving it an A- cinema score. Butler's other movie, Gods of Egypt, finished in fifth. Oh, come on. You gonna leave me all alone here with less angry Rosie O'Donnell? Last week's number one, Deadpool, fell two spots to third, earning more than $16 million in its fourth weekend. The Merc with the Mouth still has plenty to celebrate, though. It zoomed past the $300 million mark in North America. Like London Has Fallen, Tina Fey's war dramedy Whiskey Tango Foxtrot also came in behind expectations, opening with nearly $8 million for fourth place. It's one of the lower starts for the popular actress.